You think people actually live like this? What's... <laughs> I'm not sure. I don't know what's in that Fulton's original blend, but I never seen nobody that happy before. Not in real life. <laughs> Locked. Great. Ugh, we can't turn back now. Ain't got nowhere to go. There's gotta be another way through. What took you? What happened to these poor bastards? Hey, look at this! To go to waste. Use it on that bum ankle of yours. Hey, okay, come on. Let's get some distance. <laughs> This is bad. This is bad with a side of broccoli. The hell's that? Nothing. <laughs> Something my ma used to say. Over? Starting to think looking for this ward wasn't such a good idea. <laughs> Dead 
Lord ain't all gone after all. Nope. Ain't no way the war's real. Not with a nest like this out here. You know, maybe best we head back. We retrace our steps. We can find another way out. Okay. Shit. It's not far from here, but the way down collapsed behind us. We're gonna have to find another way out. Okay, this is it. would know they've lost, but they won't lay down without a fight.
were off. <sighs> hey, you okay? Not bad shooting, Traveler. Yeah, I had some practice. I'll bet. But don't worry. Ward's as safe a place as any. Safer. So... Mm -hmm. It's really real. Food, and water, and... Folks living with some old white guy? More or less. <coughs> whoa, whoa, let me get you some water. I'm fine, I... Cass, ooh, that looks like root rot. I've never seen a case this bad. I'm fine. I don't know why everyone... We need to get her to the water, and quick. <coughs> Doctor, there's her only chance. We'd better get moving. Before we lose the light. So, uh, Traveler, um, <clears throat> your friend will be fine. I'm Bo, Bo Ward, and this is Ward 13. He must have come a long way. I mean, the route's dwindling and all, but the road's still a dangerous place. What were you two doing out there? For the Ward? Really? Huh. I didn't know anybody knew what we were doing here. <laughs> We've just, uh... We've been cut off from the world for so long that... Well, I'm surprised people know about us outside the gate. Feels kind of nice, actually. Hey, ask around if you need something. Oh, start with Ford. I'm sure he'd like to meet you. You ever wonder if all this is... Like... A dream or something? What do you mean? Like... Hey, you're the newcomer, ain't you? Nora Camarillo. I keep folks alive around here. You know you're lucky they found you when they did? She's great. A real spitfire, that one. I'd uh, hang on to her if I were you. Not yet. She's asleep, and I'd like her to stay that way a spell. That girl's tough, all right. But right now, she needs rest. When she's up and about, I'll make sure you know. What you need? I'll be here if you need fixing. You ever climb to the top of that tower in the city? Clementine, you're staying, and that's final. I don't remember asking. Uh, <clears throat> we'll talk about this later. Out of my way.
have we here? Ah, the... Traveler, of course. Wallace said... Yes. Uh, right on time. Sorry you had to see that. But then again, you've been around. I'm sure you know. Families fight. Andrew Ford. Good to make your acquaintance in the flesh. Huh, how about that? I'm sure you've got a lot of questions, and I've got a favor to ask. So let's get to it. You first. That's a longer story than I can indulge right now. Let's keep it to this. You know how some things you drink can make you drunk, and some things you eat can make you sick or sleepy? Well, other things do this. It's a big world out there. It's a great answer, just not a full one. Ah, uh, not you precisely, as in name, rank, serial number. But I knew someone was coming. Our young Wallace told me. Wallace? He's a special kid. A lot like... Somebody I used to know. She had bad dreams, too. Dreams about things that hadn't yet come to pass. It's more like he can see really far into the present, sometimes. All right, Traveler. Now that you've shot your shot, here's mine. I need an able young scrapper to help an old man out. Talk to Wally. You'll find him out by the docks. After that, gear up, and then meet me at the ward gate. I'll tell you a story. Okay. Mr. Mayor should just listen more, like you and I do. I see you, Traveler. You're the one Ford's been waiting for, though he doesn't know he's been waiting. He thinks he needs help. It's her who needs it. You know, and you don't. So, I'm Wallace. Did I say that yet? Probably. You have a pa- Makes a lot of sense now. You're right, of course. Your path is waiting. Tell Brabus and McCabe I sent you. They have what you need. They're the next step on your journey. Goodbye, traveler.
Ooh, I wonder if I can make a, a decent trap out of that one. Mm. Well, ain't you a right mutter? That boy what talks to the root? I don't reckon he was any more specific. If he asks, he t ah, Riggs is gonna talk my ear off if I don't send you over to him next, isn't he? Fine. Go see Riggs then. Tell him he can do whatever the hell he wants. I swear to God and shit. You're serious, are all right. So what the hell is this journey? I swear. Fine. Well, so either I can Tell you what, I heard you picked up something strange on your little, maybe I could do something with. help with whatever journey he saw you on just tell wally to be more so we're done here right or do i need the hammer again oh it's a <sighs> look pisses me off when people come by so i'll make you a deal oh and if you tell anyone i was nice to you oh friend <laughs> glad to that's right but everybody calls me right. Speaking of which, Bo mentioned you might need some help getting your feet back on, do you? Well, whatever. We all help each other out here. <laughs> I don't suppose he was more particular about why. Ha! <laughs> yeah, right. Well, I've got a pretty focused skill set. I reckon I know what he means. Come to me if you ever need to upgrade your equipment. Riggs can help me out. You look ready to face anything. What do you say? Ready to see what's down there with me? Nice. I hear you. Take I'll care of whatever you... Start. We'll see over the weekend. 